little less than 24 hours, we will know who will host the 2016 Olympic Games. Now, Chicago, of course, is one of the four cities pulling out the stops to win. While city officials promise they have the money to cover the costs, there's been some mixed reaction in the Windy City on the benefits of bringing home the gold. Jeff Flock in Chicago's Washington Park with more. Jeff. I am not too far from the start of the 100-meter dash here. Can you picture a 90,000-seat stadium right on this spot where we're walking here? Amber Stengel, who is a small business owner in Chicago and a former aspiring Olympian. Uh, and you just wrote a book called Sports Traveler Chicago. What's that about? Well, Sports Traveler Chicago is a fan's guide to our city. And you like to bring here, you do travel groups to the city. This would be a huge benefit to your business, right? It really would. It would mean jobs. We would have to go and hire more people because uh, we're going to be hosting thousands of travelers from all over the globe right here in our city of Chicago. But you are a fan of the Olympic Games as well, and you know that a lot of them have come up short in terms of their budgets. Uh, the budgets tend to mushroom. Uh, are you worried about that in this city? I'm not worried about it because we already have all of our infrastructure in place. The budgets that you're talking about, things like Beijing, Vancouver, they've had to go out and build million-dollar airports, multi-million dollar airports infrastructures and those things are all in place here in chicago now you say in place although some of the infrastructure for example the olympic stadium which would be right here behind us it would be a ninety thousand seat stadium and then it would be essentially torn down after the games they say that that's the best smartest use of it uh what do you think i'm, I'm a little bit confused by that part but I, I guess it's because they think we already have so many great venues here in the city uh, things like soldier field wrigley field u.s cellular field is that we don't need another major venue we already have have it in place so they can do better use by turning this back into a park as it is now. Interesting. Yeah. Ann Britt Stingle, uh, good luck to you. Uh, her book is just out now if you want to talk about sports travel to Chicago and if you want to come here for the Olympics, tune in tomorrow here on the Fox Business Network. We will have the announcement live. We'll be down in Daly Center Plaza with a big celebration, we think, but it may not be. And if it's the other way, we'll have that for you too. Fascinating, Jeff, to watch that moment where they make the announcement. I don't care if you get it or not. It's exciting to watch. It is. See who it gets really it. is. It is. Yeah. Of course, Rio, yeah, know. Rio is pulling trip. out all their... It's really essentially between Rio and Chicago, but we'll see how it works out. Jeff, you thanks know, there's very a much. website, guys, yeah. Chicagoans for Rio. Check it out. <laughs> I have it's seen not it. Very, not very flattering That's to Chicago, but, you know, yeah. there you go. Yeah, all right. Thank exactly. you very much, Jeff. In Chicago, well, of course, they like deep dish people.